her most powerful two were light and dark. Now at this point, Mother Magic's hair had become very, very short. She would have to go and rest soon, but there was just one more issue. Who would be in charge while Mother Magic was absent? Obviously, it had to be either light or dark. Light claimed, well, I'm the brightest out of the both of us, so I should be in charge. She said, I will lead the others to a brighter future. The darkness countered, ah, but without darkness, there is no light. He continued and said, the people need a strong leader to protect them. Therefore, I should be in charge. The two began to argue over this for many, many days. Mother Magic would soon have to make a choice, but Mother Magic feared to choose either of, either one of them, for she noticed something. She saw hate growing in both of their eyes. Both had grown a bitter feeling for each other. She feared that if she left either one of them in charge, they would destroy each other and the balance of magic would break. She decided to go out into the stars and think of a new plan. She thought of an idea she'd create one last leader that would, could hold all the main magics. However, she never got the chance to. Why not? I've never heard this part of the story before. Yeah, same. 